Alexander the Great was one of the most influential figures in ancient history. He was born in 356 BC in the Kingdom of Macedonia, the son of King Philip II and Queen Olympia. Alexander grew up to become a legendary conqueror and ruler, who conquered most of the known world by the age of 33. As a young man, Alexander received an education from the famous philosopher Aristotle, who taught him philosophy, logic, and science. He also learned about military tactics and strategy from his father, King Philip II, who was a renowned military commander. When Alexander became king at the age of 20, he inherited a powerful army that his father had built. He immediately set his sights on conquering the Persian Empire, which was the dominant power in the ancient world at the time. In 334 BC, he launched a campaign against the Persians, crossing the Hellespont with an army of 35,000 men. Alexander's military tactics were innovative and effective, and he quickly defeated the Persian army in several battles, including the Battle of Issus in 333 BC. He then captured the cities of Tyre and Gaza, before finally conquering the capital of the Persian Empire, Persepolis, in 330 BC. After conquering Persia, Alexander continued to expand his empire, conquering Egypt and founding the city of Alexandria. He then marched eastward into India, where he won a decisive victory against King Porus in the Battle of the Hydaspes. However, his troops were tired and homesick, and Alexander was forced to turn back before he could conquer all of India. Alexander's conquests had a profound impact on the ancient world. He spread Greek culture and language throughout the lands he conquered, and his empire became a melting pot of different cultures and traditions. He also founded many cities and built roads and infrastructure that helped to unite his vast empire. However, Alexander's conquests came at a great cost. He lost many soldiers in battles and suffered from wounds and illnesses. He also became increasingly paranoid and megalomaniacal as he grew older, and his behavior became increasingly erratic. Alexander died in 323 BC, at the age of 33, in the city of Babylon. His death was sudden and unexpected, and the cause is still debated by historians. However, his legacy lives on, and he is remembered as one of the greatest military commanders and conquerors in history. His empire ushered in a new era of cultural exchange and paved the way for the Hellenistic period, which lasted for several centuries after his death.